This episode of Into the Music is brought to you by Coda Music. It's a great way to discover new music and listen to all of your favorite artists for free. The link is in the description. In today's episode we're going to explore Weezine. Weezine is half of the superstar reggaeton duo Weezine and Yandel, who enjoyed mainstream breakthrough success with Pal Mundo 2005. Born Juan Luis Moreira Luna on December 19, 1978 in Quillé, Puerto Rico, he and Yandel began performing as a duo in the late 90s and made their album debut in 2000 with Los Reyes del Nuevo Milenio. They later made the jump to a major label in 2003 with Mi Vida. My Life, their first for Universal subsidiary Machete Music. Pau Mundo then catapulted them to international mainstream success in 2005 and was certified gold by the RIA. The record even charted in Japan and China. Subsequently, Weezine and Yandel established their own label, Y Records, and presented an affiliate group, Los Vaqueros. The run of the duo's hit records, both albums and singles, continued, with 2007 a watershed year. They issued a new studio date, Los Extraterrestres, as well as a live offering in several collections of singles and b-sides, and undertook a global tour. They also appeared on the compilation Caribbean Connection, which featured Daddy Yankee, Inner Circle, Elephant Man, and Don Omar. They were awarded a Billboard Latin Music Award in the category of Latin Rhythm Album of the Year, Duo or Group. The year 2009 saw the release of the chart-topping live set La Revolución, which featured 50 Cent as a guest on the single Mujeres in the Club. In 2011, the rapper made a return appearance on the duo's Los Vaqueros. El Regreso, as did T-Pain, Sean Kingston, and a host of artists from their label. The album debuted in the Latin Top 10 and eventually claimed the top spot on the Latin album's charts, their fifth to do so. Their most collaborative date yet was released in 2012, Leaderist featured guest spots from Chris Brown, T-Pain, Jennifer Lopez who appeared on the first single Follow the Leader, and Daddy Yankee who appeared on the third single, Hypnotisme. The two reached the top spot on the Latin album's chart. Rumors began to spread in 2013 that Weezine and Yandel were about to split, and credence was lent when Yandel issued De Lidera Leyenda. It was followed by Weezine's solo single Que Viva La Vida, which preceded his album El Regreso del Sobreviviente. The long player hit number 3 on the Latin album's charts. The duo eventually downplayed rumors of the split and claimed to be working on a new track together at the end of 2014. But Weezin continued a busy schedule that year without Yandel. The single Adrenalina, a collaborative effort with Jennifer Lopez and Ricky Martin, and his own single Control, featuring Chris Brown and Pitbull, were both issued that calendar year. In 2015, the single Nota de Amor featuring Daddy Yankee and Carlos Vives appeared as a precursor to the full-length Los Vaqueros, La Trilogia, which was issued in the fall. The album didn't offer an appearance by Yandel but it did feature a star-studded cast that included Prince Royce, Faruko, Plan B, J. Alvarez, Tito El Bambino, and Archangel. We seen returned in 2017 with the single Escapate Conmigo, featuring Ozuna. The track peaked at number 3 on Billboard's Hot Latin Songs chart. The album Victory was issued in early Latin albums chart. 